Welcome to Textonation. Joining us is Patrick Santucci, Senior Communications Manager at DJI. Thank you for joining us, Patrick. Oh, my pleasure. Thank you for having me. DJI has something new out, not a drone this time. <laughs> it's another version of your Osmo gimbal, and this one includes a camera, and it's really small. Give us the overview. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, DJI um, is, is very much known for their drones, but uh, on almost every single one of our drones, you'll find a really high-performance gimbal. Uh, so lately, uh, if you look at our Pro line, um, you'll see a lot of introduction of our, our gimbal systems uh, meant for ground use. Uh, so this is our latest addition. It's um, the Osmo Pocket. So it's a super portable, highly compact 4K camera that fits in your pocket. And what you get is a three-axis gimbal. Uh, it shoots 4K at 60 frames per second. Um, and it has all sorts of really cool features built into uh, the app itself. Well, step us through how it how it would be used. Uh, there, there's even a screen on this, right? Yes. Uh, so um, taking a step away from our traditional uh, Osmos, uh, this guy has a small one-inch touch screen on the back. So essentially, you can use this product as a standalone product. So you don't need to connect your phone or use your phone with it. Um, so the one-inch touchscreen gives you full access to a host of creative suites. Uh, so whether it's switching between photo, video, um, changing the format of, you know, whatever you're shooting in, um, as well as accessing some of the, the modes, um, it can be operated as a standalone device. And what you get is super smooth footage uh, that's relying on our, our renowned uh, three-axis gimbals. Um, but then uh, below the one-inch touchscreen is a little port. And what you can do is you can connect uh, Lightning or you can connect USB-C. And using the brand new DJI Nemo app, uh, you can get um, an expanded functionality uh, using your phone. Um, so what that does is it gives you greater control over the gimbal, um, but it also allows you to access certain modes that you can't access in the one-inch touchscreen. Um, and one of these modes is, is brand new for DJI. It's called Story Mode. And essentially it's templates for video. And what it does is it adds in color grading, it adds in video transition, and it adds in music. And it creates these short little clips that are perfect for sharing on social. Um, but yeah, so once you plug in your phone, you get you get much more expanded use with the gimbal and, and greater control. So uh, it, from a physical standpoint, uh, how do you envision someone using both the Osmo Pocket and their phone at, at the same time? Um, well, that's, that's ideally for, I mean, you're going to use it as a standalone product if you're at a place like uh, a concert where you're raising above your head. Um, but if you're just, you know, recording, you know, your family in your backyard or your dog or whatever, um, connecting it to your phone will give you a be better control over um, the gimbal. Um, and then also within, you know, these functionalities that are built into the Osmo Pocket, uh, we have things like Active Track, uh, which you can find on our drones where you choose a subject and track it. Um, but one of the coolest new features is for those that like to vlog, um, we have um, face track. Uh, so essentially, once you put it in 180 degree camera mode, it's going to flip the camera towards you and it's going to automatically um, find a subject's face and then you'll be in the center of the frame the entire time. So use application kind of varies on what you want to do with it. Um, but it could be anything from you know, recording your, your family, your dog, your um, you know, holiday moments, you know, concerning it's Christmas and, uh, and Hanukkah uh, coming up. Um, but uh, as a standalone product, I just used it at a, at a concert over the weekend, and it was, it was pretty phenomenal. And the idea is you, you can, if, if you choose to, hold your phone in one hand, and it's tethered to the, uh, to the, Osmo, mm -hmm. on, on the Osmo Mobile on, on the other hand? Yep. Um, so, so it's a pretty strong port. Um, it's, it's, it's pretty robust and you know, I've been using it just holding the Osmo with the phone attached and I've had no issues whatsoever. Um, so that they've definitely taken care in creating a, a very strong port. Very cool. Now this is arriving soon and tell us about the uh, availability and pricing here. Yeah, sure. Um, pricing is 349 us and we are shipping December 15th. Uh, so we're taking pre-orders right now, uh, through authorized retailers or through DJI's, uh, store. Um, online, um, but we'll start shipping December 15th. And is there anything else people should know about the storage capacity and battery life, etc.? Yeah, so, so this guy will run about two hours if you're shooting 4K at 30 frames per second. Um, and then in terms of storage capacity, it requires a micro SD. 
Um, so it'll support up to 258 gigabyte micro SDs. Um, so you get plenty of storage uh, capacity depending on what you want uh, to record. Um, but yeah, the two hours is, is really solid. Um, we also have a host of different accessories um, that are coming out with it. So whether we have a wireless transmitter so you can operate it remotely. We have a focus wheel that goes in the port section of the phone so that uh, you can control the gimbal, um, again, without your mobile device, but it has a little wheel where you can control the gimbal up, down, left, right. Um, we also have a waterproof housing case that's coming out. We have um, we have a really cool uh, carrying case, which actually, which actually can charge the Osmo um, up to one full charge, but it also has slots for your micro SDs, and it has slots for our ND filters, which are also going to be available soon. Terrific. And the best place for people to go for more info is where? Uh, DJI.com. Very predictable. <laughs> Patrick Santucci, <laughs> thanks for taking the time with us. Yeah, thank you for having me. Now this. How many companies out there have continued to innovate when it comes to building a better radio? I'm Fred Fishkin, host of Text to Nation, and I'm here to tell you about the new CC SkyWave SSB radio from the wonderful people at C-Crane. Bob and his crew really love radio, and it shows in this new compact model that is packed with features. Beyond great AM and FM reception and sound, you can tune into shortwave signals from around the world. Listen to ham radio operators, aviation, and more. It's the radio you'll turn to every day, and in emergencies. It will run for nearly three days on just two AA batteries. Pair the sleep timer with the new Soft Speaker 3, and you've got the perfect radio for your nightstand. Of course, it can wake you up too. Click on Ccrane at textination.com and put in the code textination for a free flashlight with your order. They love radio, and you'll love Ccrane.